Hey guys, Jelby Zombie here. I hope you're all well and staying safe. So it's time for another unboxing video. So I am not going to waste any time because I really want to get into this. I have been wanting this for so, so long. Okay. Now, ever since I started collecting Fangoria, um, this has been my number one issue that I wanted to get. And since... I couldn't find it. I really couldn't because it would appear on eBay and then I would bid for it and then I would lose several times whenever this item popped up on eBay. Go away. Oh my god, I actually own this right now. Oh my god. Ready. And a three, and a two, and a one. There's the back. There's the front, oh my god, and thankfully, well, gratefully, he put it in a little, uh, the seller put it in a sleeve, so that's cool. Oh my god, I literally cannot believe I am holding this right now. If you're new to my channel, um, and if you don't know, The Evil Dead is my all-time favourite film, and... I absolutely love Fangoria magazine, and this is just a gem to have. Um, I believe it was from the year mm, 1981, I think. Um, or it could have been, I think it's between 81 or 82, or something like that, or it could be 1983. It's one of those. Um, and originally, this came from Forbidden Planet for £2.95. There's the old Forbidden Planet sticker. Check out that cover. That's absolutely amazing. And uh, we've also got an article on Halloween 3, Season of the Witch, um, Poltergeist, and Incubus. So there we go. And of course, the Evil Dead. There's the back. So I'm just going to quickly get to the Evil Dead article. I don't want this video to drag on for too long. Uh, oh, we've also got an article on the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. <laughs> it said it right at the top. And I didn't even notice that because I was too fixated on the Evil Dead picture. Um, okay, that's cool. Where is the Evil Dead article? Okay, well, but, well there's the Texas Chainsaw Massacre article. There we go. Uh, there's the Texas Chainsaw Massacre again. Great photos as well. Of course, this is when Fangoria did most of their uh, issues in black and white. Um, this is issue 23. And there's Ed Neal as Nubbins, the hitchhiker. One last uh, page on the Texas Chainsaw. Where's Evil Dead? Come on, this is why I bought the magazine. Where's Evil Dead? Here we go. Wow. Man, that's a big read-up. There we go. Great stuff. Nice. Man, that's a huge read-up. Check out these photos. <laughs> I like how they've pretty much shown the end of the film. So from this picture to this picture to this one as well. And this one of Cheryl. They've pretty much just shown the end of the movie. Just minus these two here. So we've got uh, Cheryl in the cellar, Bruce or Ash and Scotty, and then we've got the end of the movie pretty much. And there's a huge read up on the film. That's a that's a huge read up. And that's it. Oh, I thought I genuinely thought there'd be more than that. Wait a minute. So how many pages? One second, guys. Two. Three, four. So the, the entire magazine is based around the Evil Dead and we've only got four pages dedicated to the Evil Dead. Um, okay, uh, I, I thought there would be a bit more, but um, do you know what? I really don't care because I finally own this right now. I realise this video is going on for five minutes, so I'm going to cut it short. So that has been an unboxing of Fangoria issue 23. 
the Evil Dead edition. I am so hyped to read this and I can't believe I own it. Anyway guys, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.